Hello everybody, welcome back to Echoes of Soul, episode number 3, and here we are with a beautiful uh, fire mage, that's what she's going to be, and I think it's time to get started, shall we guys? And uh, here we are, and we left it right here, guys, if you remember, we did a few things around here, and uh, what's this? The next Magic Lab season has arrived. Oh, very nice. Loot wheel. Oops. I didn't mean that. <laughs> uh, wait, let me check my mail before anything else. Real quick. We don't have anything. Very nice. That's okay. That's okay. Let me see if I can open my chest. Well, thank you very much. It's insufficient level to open that. But look at this graphics, guys. I absolutely loving it. Free to play game, guys. What else the hell? we uh players you know people that we play games uh what, what, what else we can ask it's just it's just unbelievably good i think that is my uh, honest opinion okay so let's go for my skills shall we and what we get so far we have a mana arrow and the fireball these two are going to be the main ones for a second it won't last forever okay and we're going to have to choose a path at some stage, as you can see. And that's going to be the fire mage one. But uh, let's let's get on with that. See how we get on in this amazing, amazing game, guys. Because I absolutely love it. Uh, yeah, I'm absolutely loving it. Look at that beautiful lighting in there. Oh, absolutely loving it. Right, so what we need to do, guys. We need to talk to Gaunt. And Gaunt is around here so much. You can see the indicator here of the next uh, place we need to go. And there he is, right there. Brilliant. I love the mechanics of this uh, game. I think the developers did a really, really good job. I just can't falter so far. I really can't. Very good to meet you. And that's the time of game I like. Another cool thing is that if you play different class, so far the rewards are different as well, which is really, really cool. I, I think that is really cool. As far as I know, I played the Warlock for 10 levels, and I see already that a few of the quests give different rewards. Uh, if you are a veteran in this game, please correct me if I'm wrong, but I definitely believe that that's the case. Right. Let's do it, guys. Oh, yeah. Dude, she's strong. I mean, oh, she's strong. Lovely, sweet girl, but dude. Wow, dude, that <laughs> she is. Uh, don't mess around with my girl. That is for sure. Right, where we need to go? 114 uh, five meters, and that's the direction we need to go, as you can see on the indicator. Oh, dude, this is going to be. <laughs> this is going to be awesome. Very, very nice. Even the uh, mods and everything is really cool. The vivid colors on it—it's just so beautiful, guys. It really, really is clever. Very cleverly done. I love it. Absolutely love it. And as I said, free to play, guys. What else we want? It's just incredible. But there you go, this what it is. Let's see what else we can do around here. I'm gonna kill this guy just for the sake of it. Oh dude, this she's she's so strong. And I loving it. Loving it! If you haven't played this game and you like MMOs, RPGs, uh, you are wasting your time, guys. You really are wasting your time. Right, I think she's the first boss. King of the Hill. Unlocked a new achievement. A story orientated. Complete 10 main quests. Very, very nice. As a nice achievement there. Let me check real quick. Oh, I can't. Can I? Yes, I can. Real quick. Let's equip that really fast. Okay. And why do I have fire coming out of my arms or whatever? Right. The fate of this world is in your hands. Oh, we need to kill him. Right, that's easy, PC guys. Let's do it. Oh no, you don't. Oh, 
Oh, you have to catch me, do you? And there he goes. How cool is that? That's the uh, frozen side of things. We won the fire one, uh, but we don't want it. And what else we can do? Light of Hope. Uh, I think that's a really good one to have, I think. Let's hand the quest in and see what happens. Oh, baby. Number six. Level six, guys. Very nice indeed. And the answer to Breya's prayers. Okay, save Breya. We did it, guys. We saved Breya. And I love it. Brilliant. Oh, look. Uh, what's this? What, what are the wins for? Not too sure. Not too sure. Let's collect damage at Dark Leaks documents. That's what we need to do. Oh, we need to interact with this guy here. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, that was quick enough. Right, okay. 157. Let's go this way. And I'm going to jump forward. Because I like it. That's it. Really, look at that vivid colors, guys. It's just unbelievable. In comparison, for example, to Final Fantasy XIV, where everything is very dull and flat. Look at the colors in here. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. By the way, I'm going to say what I think about the game. If there are things that I don't like, I'm going to say it. Of course I am. And this is not a critique. This is not uh, any type of review or anything like that. That is my personal opinion. It is that things that... Um, are nice of course they are and have multiple of them and i'm going to say them as well so that you know it is what it is what's this oh i hope it's tough thank you very much i'm going to accept this one as well thank you very much let me talk to him again oh that's it <laughs> well this is what it is right what's this look at the stats one uh, plus one attack plus one creates uh, accuracy could be and two piercing well, i'm going to equip it because i like the sound of it <laughs> right, okay, let's do it, guys. Right, we need to kill these wolves in here. Bridges, uh forest wolf. Uh, let's do it. Let's crack with it, shall we? Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And, and by the way, it's really enjoyable as well. Not only is actually beautiful, uh, look-wise, is is enjoyable. It's really nice to play. Very smooth, plays beautiful. Ah, oh, just it's just it's just really really good. Oh, all right then. So my uh, war points has been registered in this new place. That's really cool. That's really cool. Right, where are we? Oh, look, more questing here. Oh, where is this? Oh, look how awesome. That is a mixture of a, a llama and a kangaroo. <laughs> oh, dude, who be, who been experimenting in here? Uh, that's the rap assistant. And um, what well, raps are basically are some type of uh, teleport network kind of thing, okay? So uh, there you go. See, you wanna work to different area, you can actually uh, teleport through these little portals, okay? So that's the way you travel from one place to another one. Really cool, very, very nice. Let's check the, uh, I love the sound of a weapons hammer. merchant because I want to sell a few things. I don't want that, and I'm going to have to be careful here, guys, with this, with these things. Uh, I don't want to get too much crap on my inventory, and then we get a bit, uh, we get a bit uh, saturated with a uh, space. I'm gonna check real quick my uh, skills. Everything remains the same, and what's this? Glacial Lance. You know, I want to have to look into the actual build because I want to be chest fire, but I'm pretty sure we are going to have to use some type of um, ice spell as well. For example, this one makes sense to me because it decreases the target's move speed by 30% for 3 seconds. That's huge, guys. You can actually kill, absolutely kill a, a enemy and slow down 30%. So there you go. This is what it is. Let's take this quest as well. All forms of life have a chaos soul within them. And let's well, add a port to Delos. You. Very nice inventory. Let me wear this one real fast. That looks quite nice. And what we need to do? 
seven meters. Oh, how long? Greetings. Is that one? Right, we need to collect some chaos souls. Collect chaos souls. Now, how do we collect the chaos souls? Not too sure, guys. Oh, oh uh, let's get out here. Let's get out here and see what happens, shall we? And it's going to be down here, so man. Down these guys here, they are fighting each other. That's it. That's the way you do it. Very nice indeed. And we need another one. Do we need... Oh, we done it. We killed both. Okay, that's cool. Let's get back to... Look at that beautiful, guys. Oh, stunning. May Odin watch over you. Okay. Brilliant. Now, by clicking V, you can actually see how many we have collected. 11 or 271, guys, okay? A cow soul can become one of four types of purified soul. Soul purification requires two chaos souls, but with co-op purification, only one chaos soul is required. Okay, so there you go. That's what it is, okay? And we have courage, peace, innocence, and hope, which, by the way, they are right here. There we go. Hope, innocence, courage, and peace. That's a different one, isn't it? Oh, no, this innocence, courage, peace, and hope. They're exactly the same ones, okay? And you can actually purify them. But we will get into that. See cobble purification right there. Uh, let's see. Let's see how it goes. And we will do that eventually, guys. We don't really need it quite yet. There you go. Now, how are we doing with time? Brilliant. We can do a bit more. So what shall we do? We need to uh, glue the paper scrap. So let's do it. What she's asking us to do? Nothing. Okay. Oh, I see. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Is this little pieces of paper? There you go. Sorted. Ah, level seven. Oh, good. It just in this game you level so fast as well, which is really cool. I think it's really good. So we can get up there and start doing the things that we need to do. That's it. End of the story. Now what we need to do? Uh, Edmita's invasion retornation. Talk to Delos. Delos is right here. Let's talk to him. Uh, give us a new top. Thank you very much for this. It's a tunic, which I need to sell because I don't want it. It's way too old. So let's find these guys in here real quick. I may have nothing, but at least I have a lot of it. Well, that's all right then. There we go. One thing that I don't like very much is the camera and have a look at the settings and doesn't you cannot change it, it's what it is. And you can see as you uh, if you decide to uh, change direction, the camera doesn't move with the uh, character. You need to rotate the camera as you move as well, or you change directions. That I don't like that very much, but that's my personal opinion. You may like that type of uh, setting. I definitely don't. Right, we need to go to do what? We need to kill corrupted spirits. And you know what? That's what we do. We kill spirits and corrupted and no corrupted and wolves and whatever comes. Oh, is this the same again? Oh, well. It says that we need to kill them. Well, let's do it. All right, one dead. And the next one is going to be this fellow here, him. Very nice. Let's go back real quick. Brilliant. In terms of the total damage, we are doing 34, which is our 100%, of course. That's how... Um, that's how uh, this total damage um, works in, in these um, meters. Damn it, I will say it in damage meters. So uh, we're doing 34, which is the 100% the maximum you can do 34. So we're doing really, really well. Really well. Yeah, purify my soul. 
Whenever you need to purify souls or recharge your rest bonus, simply visit the Soul Sanctum. These sanctums can be found in camps across the globe. A fully charged rest bonus allows you to earn additional XP in battle. Brilliant, so what they do when Kill you purify... Monsters to collect chaos souls. Though valueless on their own, you, as a soul keeper, have the ability to purify these souls. Chaos souls can be purified into four different kinds of souls. Hope, innocence, courage, and peace. These purified souls can then be used to perform powerful skills, or to craft items in conjunction with professions and hobbies. Souls of all types are stored in your soul satchel, which can be opened using the menu or by pressing the V key. Enter the number of souls you wish to purify and click the purify button. Each purified soul requires two chaos souls. Okay, brilliant. So there you go, this is the purifying machine if you like. Right here. And uh, obviously you need a minimum of uh, six, I think you said, or two or whatever. And uh, you can actually purify, you see? So we have uh, three soul of hope in there, which is the main one that we are using. Purify it requires two chaos souls. And uh, I think, I think guys, we're doing really well, really, really well. Now, do we really have to purify these uh, three here? Not too sure, not too sure. Let's go see the solar skills a second. And that is the light of hope, which is the one that we are using. It's not too bad, not too bad at the moment, okay? Let's uh, hand the quest in. Uh, purify my soul, it's all done. And we are going to get two Kaya souls. Well, thank you very much for that. Speed up the purification process by teaming up with a fellow soul keeper. Co-op purification can be performed even when no soul sanctum is present. It's right, probably you can do that with someone else as well, but we are not going to get into that because I'm not going to do it. Okay, and what we have? Uh, read the, the letter. The letter. <laughs> okay, close. Let's hand them in again. And as you can see, things happen really, really fast in this game. And you obviously, if you want to get into the storyline, you need to read and all that kind of thing, but I'm not going to. Now, what we need to do, get uh, Yama from nothing now, right? And that's the mount it's going to be, isn't it? Do you need something? What are Yama? Oh, dude, what oh, wonderful. Right, and now we need to go somewhere. Brilliant, that, that's, that's awesome, I think. That's really, really cool, guys. Really, really cool. Let's get out of the way of these wolves. And there you go. That is injured Nemo's guard. Ouch. And there you go. And we need to enter the portal now, guys. But that's not going to happen in the next episode because we finished right here. 20 minutes episode. I think it's enough for today. I don't want it to make it too long. What do you think, guys? I think it's beautiful. Absolutely awesome, awesome game. So there you go. Uh, I hope to see you in the next episode. Please comment, subscribe, and like. And I hope to see you then. Until then, take great care.